must demand and we will demand that our public schools provide our children with the type of education that makes them job ready and college ready when they graduate. Public safety, the fire, the police, correction, homeland security. You do a great job. You put your lives on the line every day for us, and we appreciate it. We will support you, make sure that you have the materials, the tools, the technology you need to do your job. That I will guarantee you. This combination coming here today is going to help us build not just a hospital, but a regional medical center here in Prince George's County. Healthcare, quality access to healthcare, how it should be done in the nation, the model should be Prince George's County. This fund will help transform Prince George's County, will give the thing that we want it most. And it's already happening. People are looking and saying, wow, that's what's going to make the difference. That's why I'm happy to sign this bill. And that's why we're here and where it's going to make a difference. Not just here, but throughout Prince George's County. Economic development. The world should come here and see what the model is like to do transit-oriented development. Because we have all the things that we need, a talented and educated population, a sophisticated population, a caring population, but most important, a population that understands its tremendous responsibilities and its blessing.
gets a chance to be the leader in one of the three critical areas we're going to face over the next 20 years. We're going to face education, public safety, and health care. And so the responsibility that we have in Prince George's County is to show the world exactly what we know. And that is this community, this county, can govern itself, can make a difference in, in the lives of not just Prince Georgians, but the nation.